Hey everyone, Irix Guy here. I wanted to take a moment to explain how to export a video project from Final Cut Pro 10 in a format that's good for YouTube. Now there is a built-in YouTube uploader within Final Cut Pro 10, but I've never been a fan of that. And the reason being is that uh, it uh, YouTube is is constantly changing settings on their end, so that doesn't always work. So I found it's best to export the project and then manually upload it to YouTube through a uh, through a web browser. So what you're going to want to do in Final Cut Pro is go to the top left where it says File. You're going to go to Share. And I've got it here. You can see it says HD 1080p. So that's what I use for my for all my YouTube videos. But what you'll need to do, because that's not going to be on yours by default, you're going to need to select Add Destination. Once you're in Add Destination, uh, here at the bottom, select Add Destination. Over to the right, select Compressor Settings. And then you're going to want to scroll down. There's a lot of groups here. And the one that I choose to use is Video Sharing Services HD 1080p. And there's other settings on here too. If you didn't want to do 1080p HD, you could do 720, 540, 480, whatever you may want to use. But this HD 1080p under Video Sharing Services is the one that I prefer to use. So what you would do, you would just click OK there, which I'm not going to because I've already added it. And then once you hit OK there, when you go to your, uh, you select your project that you want to export, you'll just do File, Share, and then select HD 1080p, or whatever setting you chose. I, like I said, I prefer HD 1080p, so do that. And then once you've selected that, you simply, uh, you hit Next, and then just save it to your desktop or wherever that's it it's that simple so that's how to export a project in what I feel are the optimal video settings for YouTube and then obviously you know the next step once it finishes exporting you can uh, you can uh, upload it to YouTube by way of web browser so it's really simple and another advantage to uh, to this that I didn't mention earlier if you use the if if you had used the upload to YouTube feature in the past for Final Cut Pro 10, that would basically render your Final Cut Pro 10 useless while it was exporting. But with this export procedure, you can work on other projects while your uh, while your other projects exporting. So it's a time saver as well. Uh, thanks for watching. Subscribe if you haven't already. It's YouTube.com forward slash Irix guy. Y'all have a good day.